Welcome back, YouTube, to another video. This is episode six, well, five, if you can say that, because it's on the same day. We are back with classic. And... I decided to pop the record button. I did a little bit of offline camera stuff and I finally found the moonwell that I was supposed to go to. Went to Dark Sword. That was a mistake because I wasn't supposed to be though yet. Went back to my starting zone. And whoops. I don't know why there was a black bar under my game. That is not good. Exit game because that is going to bug bug me and the only thing I can do is reset it. So I, I did some offline camera, killed some mobs, I got my first green, too bad I can't use it, dang it. I finally found my first green item and I can't equip it because I don't use an axe. So I will save that into my bank and go from there. So we've, I did the Moonwell quest, I am on my way to pick up a new quest before I do the mobs that I'm stuck on because there's two of them and I, I get my butt kicked because I'm a caster, I don't have AoE, I'm not, I don't have Bell unlocked yet, so as usable, yeah. I'm doing it with not so light, it's gonna be dark. Uh, but yeah, it classic feels very different than retail. I love it because it feels like Skyrim, it feels like your old RPG and old Final Fantasy series as well. So that's fun. Uh, let me show you. I've picked up stuff, but I can't do it. I can't do this yet. So I just did, I think this one, yes, I just did Crown of the Earth and now I'm looking, I'm stuck on this one because, yeah, two mobs kick my butt. And so I'm going to do this one. But first I have to, oh yeah, I, I died and have to repel. So I'm on my way south right now. Oh yeah, I'll show you what I, I killed. My, my, why not? I killed my bird. I killed birds. Just for, uh, though, eggs and I got some cloth, more cloth. Ooh, okay. So I, I need one more egg and then I have a full stock. And then I can make that cooking item to sell. So that's always about saving your money but since you have no idea what you're doing and you die constantly repair 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 and that's what i'm doing suddenly uh it went over here but i mean this game makes you think use your brain and i love it because mo the modern is like uh turn in a quest you have a marker, 
uh, blue outline what well the area is go to it symbol right now this one makes you work for every little thing and I love it I feel okay so I need to drop something what do I drop a 12 versus okay but that can uh, spider, small spider. Well, since that only has one and it's only three copper, yeah, drop this. Now I have more eggs. Give me 40 copper, but it'll duplicate when I. Yeah, I, I killed all these mobs, got some cloth. Nearly died because I had three mobs on me this time. But I survived. Barely. I said I recorded it, but I mean, I can probably recreate it if I keep going up here, but I'm on my way to. Oh, wow, the thing just spawned. I'm like, okay, aggro it before it aggroes me. I have a talent spell. Talent points I have yet to use because everyone says go feral and why well, I looked it up on Icy Reigns because I just put in classic druid talent system. Icy Reigns came up and is either tank slash DPS or fully feral. Uh, me, I'm probably going to do DPS lost tank because in Legion I happen to just go full out tank but I DPS as it because actually I swap between cat and tank all the time because when facing with elite silver uh, silver mobs or uh, they got me pretty good if I was not in survival mode. What in the world do I mean? Tanks, you take, you have more armor, therefore you are better suited to take more damage and can survive longer than if you were a DPS. And as a DPS, my health could not compete to, I was losing two months HP and I couldn't gain it enough to stay in the fight. I would always kneel death or did die to a elite silver rail. Quote, silver, because once you kill it, it's not a silver anymore. So I would always swap between feral and barrel. So, yeah, that, that trend will probably follow into this game as well, just because I do a lot of solo content, therefore I don't have a healer or another DPS that can back me up. So you have to think before you do. Because in this game, it's kind of like, okay, I need more heals, more survivability rate, and yeah. So I'm slowly making my way up here. I could do, uh, I'll kill the, okay, so just talk to this thing. Oh, I thought that was, okay, that's not gonna attack me. Oh, crap. Um, what is my lowest? 25 copper or 16 copper? Okay. Mm, do I really, or should I just go back to the end and 
wasn't no I'm sorry I need more bags okay turn picked up a quest no. But yeah, you had to survive longer than what you're fighting. And I noticed I always go tank when it when I'm dealing with large amounts of groups. And that that's why I and then I just stayed in Guardian, I think. For the majority of the time. I I don't really remember. Because when I'm dealing like with five mobs and my travel is, is a short burst of DPS, and then I, I just... Oh no, I ran out of my... My rage, and... Or... And then you just, you just die, because you, you can't use your abilities. Because you ran out of energy, or whatever it is you use. So that's why I dropped into Guardian because it was easier to maintain DPS. Because I can just spam my AoE if I needed it. But chances are I, I didn't because I always... I, I mastered Guardian, it just, it just feels like, so it's like, do I want full-on tank, or do I want full-on... Well, there's only two specs, DPS or dual. Me? Going dual. Because senses are, I am probably going to be doing both. Don't know yet because I'm only in level 10 and without Val. So, yeah. Kill everything as you walk to the inn and just get all that good old XP. And items to sell because I'm slowly. Yeah. But yeah, it is a good, good, good XP rate. By XP rate, I literally mean experience for your brain. Because you're always thinking. It makes you work for everything. And that's good. Because most games nowadays, too easy. The bar is set so low, it is ridiculous. So, yeah. I'm going to just ignore because there was a pally that I heard, warrior or whatever, I don't remember. But, yeah. I could kill you for your cloth, but I'm saving it for a big stack. And I don't know if I want to craft my own bags, or do I just go full on leather and skinner? Probably leather and skinner to make my items. Look at that one I need to kill. I'm not in it for, for gold making. I am in it for what is more useful for me. Everyone begs it for gold. I go versatility. Wait, give me. But yeah, I mean, when you use your brain, you just, it's, it, it's better. But I guess that's why I'm a light worker, because I think and see things differently, even in the games. Like I said earlier, I read stuff, some read my class text and quest, talking to that bell, and it's like, oh. It reminds me of being a light worker. So there was always hidden lore everywhere. But you have to be aware of it and 
to be to know and to see it and then to learn from it if that makes sense so sell my stuff do okay ooh i almost have two stacks of that good so go to the cook I sort of repelled, but actually I never did turn latex plus on. Go to wait. Go to you. Give me. Yay. Two more quads, and I should level. What do I have here? Okay, so I have a DP a, a pff, armor buff. So by sixty-five versus. Oh wow, okay. No wonder I suck. This one just sucks. It just sucks. I I never liked this spell. However, in modern, it's better. But right now, I prefer the other one. Unless I'm just not using this right because it feels super weak. Um, maybe it's because I don't. What? Are you fucking serious? Damn it. Good thing I was not in a fight. Well, I have to end it here because I cannot play anymore. What sucks.